In this series of videos, we're going to go over how to use some of the different functionalities in Qualtrics from creating a project into creating lots of different types of questions that you guys can use for your surveys. In this first video, we're just going to go over how to create a new survey in Qualtrics and how to share that survey with other members of your team. So the first thing you're going to want to do is log in to your Qualtrics account. And once you log in, this screen will come up. This is your home screen where your survey will be once it's been created. To create the survey, go to the right side of the screen and hit Create Project. You're going to want to give your project a name. You can name it based on the topic of your research or whatever your team wants it to be. For the purpose of this video, we're just going to call this a test survey. And the project does not need to be placed in a folder. It'll just show up on your home page every time you log into Qualtrics. So once you've come up with a name, go ahead and select Create Project. And once you select Create Project, this is a screen that's going to come up. So you can see it's already automated a question, just a multiple choice question for us. But from here, this is a screen where you'll be able to create questions and edit the survey as you're creating it. So now we want to make sure that all of the members of the team can have access to the survey. So to do this, go ahead and go back to My Projects. And once you're here, you're going to want to select this down arrow to this drop down menu and hit share project. And right in this box, you're going to type in the username, preferably the email addresses of every team member. And what you should use is the DU email address they use to create their Qualtrics accounts. And when you're adding your team members, make sure that they can edit, view reports and deactivate the survey. Make sure they have access to they can do anything in the survey. So once you have entered everyone's email addresses, make sure you hit save. And once you hit save, that'll send an email to the team members with a link to the survey. And once they click on the link, the survey will appear in their home screen on Qualtrics as well. So that's it for this video. In the next video, we'll go over how to create different types of questions.